Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about tab control in csop.net windows form. So let's go to the toolbox and here write to tab control. So if you like to know about the tab control, so here uh, manage and display to the user collection of tabs that contain controls and components. So this is the definition. So let's uh, drag this for uh, tab control. So this is the structure of uh, tab controls. So this is the ready-made uh, structure of tab controls. So I am going to show you how to create the tab control by writing a uh, code. So first I am going to order it to this one. So add here, double click on form. So this is the form load event. It's open here. Write to uh, tab control. So uh, move the cursor here. So about management manages a related set of tab pages. So this is the word and here. Get the object TV and uh, here new or uh, tab control. So TV is the object of tab control. So I am using or uh, TV dot. So first I am going to set the back color. Back color equal to color dot white. So color dot white here. Now here after setting for color TV dot or uh, for or uh, color equal to color dot black. Now here after or uh, creating a font. So at here TV or uh, dot here. A font equal to new a font. So at here I'm giving at here the tab is Corbin. A uh, Corbin is the tab, and uh, here giving the size eight. And here after TB dot a uh, first is width. So setting the width at here to fifty five. And here TV dot here height. So giving the height to 55. And here after adding the uh, object control start add method. So adding add here object of tab control. So let's execute and see. So at your tab control it's created. Now next is I'm going to create at your tab pages. So at your let's uh, write the code and uh, here tab of uh, pages. So tab pages here giving creating object is one equal to new or uh, tab page and here after tz one. So add your first uh, here setting the text. So text equal to here. See add here the tab is file, edit, view, project. So add here I'm going to write your file. Now here after or tg one dot to back color equal to color dot. Or uh, color dot dark rate. So uh, let's give blue dark blue. And you have to or uh, tc for dot or uh, for color equal to color dot white. You can give any color whatever you like. And here after tc one dot here. Next is font. Setting the font at here by giving new font here or oh, tab or oh, column and here the size 8. Now here after tc one dot weight equal to here giving the weight 155. 
and here after tc one dot height so setting the height 155 and here after tb dot of uh, or tab pieces dot here using add method and here passing tc1 so this the one or tab page it will also so let's check so see it here file tab page it's now appear here so if you want you can create many tab pages so you, what you need to do add here only you need to uh, copy and paste so copy add here and uh, paste it down and here uh, only you need to change the object name so changing add here tc2 here this is the tc2 tc2 Add your tc2, let's change and here give tc2 and uh, do little bit modification. First is file here, add it. So add here, give add here, add it. Now next is uh, dark here, giving red and you have to um, oh, it's uh, all fine here, giving the size at your uh, 55 only. Now let's execute and check. So see at here, it's uh, added and file or, or tab pages added. So if you go to the added, click on edit. So at here, the color changed. So file added. So this is the way we can uh, create tab control by writing this piece of code. Or here after, or you can go uh, track. So this is the form, uh, sorry. So this is the uh, code to create the tab pages or you can directly or create the or uh, drag and drop only you can directly do drag and drop so tab control here so here you need to click on this option here so if you want then here from here you can remove the tab if you want here from you can add the tab so add here it's the tab added if you want then you can remove and uh, here after So here after I'm going to show you how to create a uh, or tab or page dynamically. So here I'm going to first uh, mark this all or uh, comment. So compiler can't understand anything. So it's all on comment. Now here after inside to uh, or form load here I'm going to write uh, the code to add a uh, tab pages dynamically. So right here it's already in oh, here or tab page one tab page two. So let's add one new. So add here or uh, create object tab or uh, page or uh, or teasing and uh, here new keyword. So tab page is object created. Now let's create one button control. So add here giving the name bt and one and your new button so button control added here now here after btn1 not to here btn so created object btn only so right here setting of our text or btn so here click on button so this the text will display on button control now here after btn Video dot to or uh, doc equal to doc star dot. So you can select to uh, anyone whatever you like. So I'm going to select to uh, bottom and uh, here of to or uh, btn dot and uh, here I'm going to use click event. So this is the click event. So plus equal to 
or new so event handler directly it's come there so about the event handler so it handle auto event occur so that handle so inside of uh, or uh, you have to pass the event so here let's go to uh, form design so i am going to double click there so this is the one event generated so you can directly paste or you should write at here or tab or page one underscore click so this is the event we have to pass so when i click on button so add here tab page one so this event generated event handle so now control comes to this point you have to add your whatever the things there so that display to the output so write to or tz or dot so add your control or control start to add method so that i'm going to add b t m so button added now here after tab control one dot here or tab pages or dot add method so that i'm going to add to or tz no so here of to let's write to tab or control dot to or selected or tab so selected tab equal to or tc so this is the code so let's execute and check so i do see oh so I do I think uh, I forget to give the name. So here or uh, click on button it's uh, okay and uh, so it's so uh, created or uh, tab control but it's a uh, blank. So at here uh, I'm going to uh, give at here. Uh, so let's give at your uh, of view now execute one more time so see at here view it's so display at here so let's click on button so if i click on button or oh, nothing is so displaying or i don't know whether it's a uh, click event fire or not so to check uh, or either click event to fire or not so let's go there or tab pages and here write message box dot so and inside of write button fire so uh, when i click on button so that control comes to this point here that display button fire so let's execute and check So add here uh, one or tab or dynamically or uh, created the name is here. So this is a directly drag and drop here. This the created by or uh, or dynamically created by code. So I'm going to click on button. So see at here button fire. It's a display. Now here after let's go to form design. So I don't want this to not look tab pages. So if you want to change the name or text, so here. You should write at here or uh, file. So see at here the name changed. And here after tab page. So tab page to selected here or uh, file after edit. So see at here it's, uh, both are changed. Now here after I'm going to show you some properties of uh, tab page too. So here, this is so here. If you want, then from here you can change the color. So going to give it here, maroon. So see it here, the color change. So this is the back color, and uh, so if you want, then here you can change the for color. So okay, giving it here, this one. Now here after or tab first to selected. So that's 
tab page one here and here if you want to add some uh, page of uh, picture in the tab so uh, add here click on uh, background image so from here you can select any kind of image you know? so i'm going to select uh, sunset so it's uh, now so this is the image that uh, i just uh, added and you have to lots of uh, uh, events are available. So according to project requirement, I will discuss in my upcoming uh, videos and uh, this is all uh, a property you should try to check and if you have find any difficulty, leave your comment. Now let's execute and see. So add here file and here edit. So it's a uh, view. So view is still created by dynamically. Now I'm going to click on file. So see at here, there's the picture here, add it. This is here. Color and here yeah, is the view. If I click on button, so button five, it's a display. Now, here after let's see some interesting uh, code about here. So, if uh, I'm no, I if I'm going to disable this all or tab, so add your right or tab control one dot enable. So, one property is enable. So, make it by default so. True. So I'm going to make it false. Now here after uh, execute, so see at here it's all are disabled. So if I'm going to click anywhere, it's not working because I set the property enable to false. So this is the one property, and uh, here after I'm going to comment to this all. So here after one important property the next word is I'm going to add here tab or, or directly so add here um, one at a time three four tab I'm going to add so add here tab or write the tab or, or page and here or this, the, this should be array tab and here tc1 equal to a new or tab page and uh, here write uh, so at here give new or tab page so here I'm going to write analyze when to have new tab page window app so let's so uh, here let's uh, showing error so here yeah. semicolon not required now here yeah, after semicolon yeah. now let's execute and check And one more thing, I forget to add the controls. So, or tab one, control start, or tab, or pages, or dot add. So, add here, I have to give add range. When you are using array, so give add here, add range, pass, daisy, one. So, let's so execute. So see at here, it's a file or uh, add it, analyze and window, it's one more app. So this is the way we can uh, put at your tab pages or uh, more. And uh, here the size is very small. So if you want to increase the size, so from here you can increase the size also. Now let's execute one more time. So we have add here file, add it, analyze, window, and it's all on this one. So this is the way we can create uh, multiple uh, tab pages.
so by using array so this is the one or demo of tab control in csr.net windows form so i hope that this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so if you have any doubt leave a comment definitely i'll reply so thank you